Well, we're back, and it looks like Bacata's still poisoned. Oh, Bacata, you and your poisoning. Monster. to try and get rid of the sad face by Kata. Well, let's see. Let's try casting... Well, let's go back. Oh, there's a monster. Let's kill him. Now cast the other spell. Come on. I don't have enough magic. Getting sneaky on me.
I don't have enough magic. So, I was thinking about what games I should play and seeing that really, I don't know, there's a lot of people who can play, uh, Lands of Lore, um, Ultima 7 differently. Thinking I'm gonna try and crack that. Um, let's see what else do I have? I have. I think I have a King's Cup somewhere that I never really got further than. Um, I, I, I never got very far in that game. Then again, I never really tried. Quest and a fairly good selection of modern games, actually. <laughs> you know, I think I might have the old fable. You know, not the um, not the one with the annoying little git of a kid. The, the one where you're all like, "Ooh, I am <laughs> of walking a very thin line of being ultimate evil or ultimate good, with no middle ground." So awesome. Oh my god, game it. Most of the moral, moral choice games get on my nerves, because it's not, you know, I can be good, good, evil, good, good, or, sorry, let, let's use a D D term, shall we? Killed it. Ooh. Lawful good. Lawful good. <clears throat> Neutral good. Chaos good. Ka uh, lawful good. Neutral. Chaotic neutral. I don't have enough magic. Chaotic neutral. Lawful evil. Evil. Uh, things actually, um. To my argument, I'm getting so tired of these games that tout this morality system, but there's no real benefit of being either good or evil other than a few plot lines, and you might turn dark or light depending on how you go. Ooh, that'd be bad. Hey. What's going on? Something smells rotten. Help! I'm drowning! Well, what a good place to save. Alright, I'll see you all back soon.